Hey all my lovelies, it's Sassy Sam, back for another video for you. I'm sorry I haven't put in a little while, it's been a little hectic lately, but after working all day today, I'm here to give you one, so I apologize ahead of time if I look a little tired, it was a long day. Okay, so I had a request for a song, it was Red Red Wine, so I figure I'm going to do something related to the red. Now... Um, people always wonder sometimes, like when you teeth the yellowing and stuff, like how she shams as well, uh, things that can make them look a little whiter. Besides using whitening strips or whitening paste to put on your teeth and stuff to whiten them, we know that can help whiten them, but it's also bad for the enamel on your teeth. So, I figured to show you a few little hints of things to help make your teeth look whiter. Now, always remember like undertones, like I've mentioned before in the past, there's blue undertones and there's yellow undertones and, well, undertones actually make a difference when you're actually wearing lipstick too. When you're wearing lipstick, um, sometimes more blue undertones will help as far as making your teeth look whiter. If you go more with yellow undertones, it's only going to bring out your, your yellow more. So the best bet is to try to do blue undertones. I know not everybody looks great in blue undertones. It's not my favorites either, but even if you have some kind of a base to it that's a little bit more blue or undertoned and you don't want to do the white strips for your teeth, um, try doing something more blue based. So I'll give you an example. I didn't put nothing on my lips now. I'll give you a few colors to show you what I mean by blue undertone. Now for instance, if I was going to do a red, not a huge red wearer myself, but if I was to going to wear and I wanted my teeth to look whiter, get something a little more blue based in a red okay so I'm just going to show you quickly if I was to do the blue base red I'm just going to put a little lip liner on here just to help my line quick always bring out that lovely bow in your lips it gives a better shape to your lip okay I'm just going to I'll line this quick just so I can give you an idea. Okay. Using my number three to smudge it a little. You know me and my number three. It's always handy. Sassy says a poet. Didn't you know it? Hey. Okay. So now I'm going to use this NYX gloss. It's a thick, thick pigment one. And you're going to see what I mean by oh, this is a more of a, a vibrant Blue base. Red. Mm-hmm. Now, Sassy Sand doesn't have the way to steer around, but notice when you put a color like this on, cheese. They tend to look whiter. I like these reds. Is your red. Give me. Okay, so this is the red, for instance, blue undertone. So, see, cheese. It makes them look whiter. That's one color. Okay. No, oh, this is gonna be messy. I'm gonna take the red off now. I'm gonna give you an example now. Another blue undertone. If you're not a red lover, which, like me, I'm not. Let me just kind of wait this out a little bit, too. You always want to get a true, another little tip. You want to get a true color of a lipstick and not have it take the undertone of your lips. Because sometimes people's lips are blue-based and it can change the color, make it more blue undertoned in a lipstick. And if you're trying not to do that, you want to get a true color of a lipstick, Put the foundation right over your lips first. You can set it with a little powder if you want it to last. Um, right now I'm just going to do it with this foundation. It's just a little more of a semi-matte texture to it. So I'm just going to do this just to show you the colors quick. Okay, so now I'm going to do another blue undertone. It'll be more of a plum blue undertone base. So now I'm going to do one like this. It's kind of a pinky plum. Okay, so do the liner. And face it, not everybody likes red. I'm not a huge fan of red. Very rarely. 
will I wear it? Okay. Just try to do this as quick as we can here. All right. And now I'm gonna do the pop up of the. It's just kind of like a purpley pinky color. Blue base. Blue undertone. Ooh, this is deeper than I thought. Okay. You know, these kind of colors too are always nice if you got a vibrant color like that to kind of subdue the rest of the makeup so it's not so stick out vibrant wise like overdone. Colors like these always look better when the rest of your makeup is kind of soft. So that is another blue undertone base. Kind of nice. When it's everything else is subdued, these colors don't look so like they stand out so much. It's like your one pop of color. Okay. So this was another example. Okay. Now, <laughs> off with it we go. And now I'm going to show you what a yellow undertone. See? Yeah, I don't have pearly whites, but this does make them look quieter. Don't mind. That's just the insane tooth. I've had it all my life, but you know what? I accept me for me, and we all should love ourselves for ourselves, right? I love you all no matter how you are. So, everybody has little imperfections. Who cares? It makes us unique. Okay. Now I'm going to take this one off. Woo, I look like I'm stained. All right. I'm going to do the little foundation again, just to touch up quick. Get the true color of the lip color. Okay. Now, this is what an example of like a yellow undertone is. This is kind of more of a coral color. Yellow undertone base. More neutral. And it does not make your teeth look as white. I mean, yeah, it's a nice color. Wear it if you want. But if you want to make your teeth look whiter, those are the kind of colors, the blue undertones, that'll do it more for you. These are just more neutrally, but they don't do nothing for your teeth. So let's just do a little lip lining here. A yellow undertone base. Because I wanted you to see a comparison. A little smudge of the number three. And let's do this color. This one's more neutrally lighter colored. Okay. Not as vibrant, more neutral based. Do they make my tea like this white? No, they don't. Actual looking, subdued, but geez, yeah, no, my whites don't look as white. So this is just an instance of the yellow undertone base. The other one was blue undertone base. So that's my little hint for you. You wanna make your lips another yellow undertone base, like just kind of a corally color like these. These are more yellow undertones. Base. So you can see the difference. I say a yellow undertone base and a blue base. See the difference in colors. These will bring out the light. These will not. So, like I said, not everybody looks good in those colors, but there are variations you can do. You get my gist, but I mean by a blue undertone base. Okay? So, that was my song. That was my little lesson for you today. Just a little quickie. Now, this goes out to Kim, because you wanted you be party. Red, red one. Are you ready, girl? Cheers. Okay, I'm cheating. It's cranberry juice. You get the gist of it. This goes out to you, girl. Ready? 
Red, red wine Stay close to me Don't let me be alone It's tearing apart My blue heart Ready? Red, red wine, you make me feel so fine. You keep me rocking all of the time. <laughs> My song to you, gimme girl. Cheers, my dear. Please, anybody else, songs, suggestions, give them to me and I'll incorporate them in my videos. This is Sassy Sin giving you one more hint. Come back and stay tuned. There will be more.